Hello Hi friends. friends, welcome to yet another fun field and exciting episode of your favorite show, My Zone Active Kids, where we actively invest in your, your future. future. Whose future? Your, your future. future. <laughs> yes, so my name is Mario and I'm joined by the lovely Teresia here. Yay! Yes. Uh, it's a lovely Monday. It's not blue. Definitely. Uh -huh. It's not blue like all the other Mondays. It is Easter weekend and we got enough rest. Definitely. Yes, so today... Uh, we will be dealing with the theme of different religions and mm -hmm. today specifically we are going to talk about what are we going to talk about christianity you heard yes, yes. yes. so today we're talking about christianity and like we mentioned this week we're going to cover all the other different religions so you should just stay tuned make sure you watch every single day because tomorrow we're going to cover something else but for t but for today like my friend here maria mentioned today mm -hmm. we're talking about Christianity. Christianity. Now, Maria, do you perhaps have an idea what Christianity is about? Well, I grew up in Christianity, okay. actually. Yeah. So That's how I was brought up. Is it? So, yeah. what is the main? What did you do during Easter? What was the main thing that you did during Easter? What did you learn about? What was the most spoken thing about during Easter? Uh, okay. Let me see. Let me go with the door, but okay. I remember the <laughs> endless church days, bro. Like, <laughs> like yeah. for, the, the, for the week before Easter, mm -hmm. we have to go to church, like, uh, it, I think it's like at, at sunset or like yeah. late yeah. afternoon, mm -hmm. like every day from Monday <laughs> <laughs> up until Easter. Yes. I was, that's the one thing I, 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 I never forget. So we spend a lot of time worshipping, or people spend a lot of time worshipping. Mm -hmm. So Easter, people who believe in God and Christianity um, are people who believe that Jesus died for us on the cross for Definitely. all our sins. So, so, okay. So basically, people who believe in Christianity or people who are Christians believe that Jesus died for them on the cross for all their sins so that they're able to get a second chance in life. So basically, if you make a boo-boo today, you shouldn't feel really bad about it. Do you know why? Why? Because Jesus died for Ooh. all the Christians out there on the cross. Uh, no, I feel like you're putting it in a way that you can sin oh, because your sins have already no, been no, 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 like no. redeemed or something. No, like. no, that's not what I said. No, that, I that's, just, that's what you made it seem like. No, that's not what I said. Okay, <laughs> but I just said basically mm -hmm. that it just means that even if you make a mistake, mm -hmm. right, mm -hmm. um, God or Jesus um, will forgive you for it as long as you are really genuinely sorry for it you have to be sorry and you have to learn from your mistakes and i believe these are things that most people and most kids out there and i'm sure that you my friends have learned this as well that when you do something wrong mm -hmm. apologize for it change it and move on yeah exactly so no sin is bigger than than um the christian's lord yeah i think yes yeah so no yes. matter what sin you 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 think you have to, okay let's put it in the way that don't go out there sinning what uh having the what the mentality that no uh, he will just forgive me because nothing is bigger and stuff like yes that. so uh, it all i'm not sure about people. that but i feel like that's that's how it is basically exactly like, whatever you do or whatever you have done in the past yeah the christian god will forgive you definitely but nonetheless don't forget you know give us your two cents tell me what mm -hmm. you believe if you are a christian if you my friend are a christian let us know how you feel about this that's of comments. course comments abuse those comments please exactly on our social media platforms that mm -hmm. is on facebook instagram instagram yes and don't forget to catch us on our website that is oneup.com and on our dstv channel 285 and go tv channel 94 and remember on the 17th of april we'll be moving to channel 25 exactly yeah. but nonetheless <laughs> also remember that we are sitting comfortably today and this is all three thanks to our friends all the way at innovation for Shout our out. exactly for our lovely lovely mm -hmm. bean bags Definitely. But for now, let's head on to story time with my favorite friends. That's of course Zoe and, and Zeki. Active Kids is an initiative under My Zone that aims to provide exciting and easy activities and fun stories. Zoe, Zaki, and Zoshi are the puppets who share their stories and help children to learn more about the specific focus areas of the day and week. 
On this show, we have arts and crafts where we create fun and unique art projects with the children, which ties into the theme of the day. Each show also has a slot dedicated to fun and easy active activity that the children can do at home with friends and family. The aim is to exercise their minds and bodies in fun and easy ways to keep the children active and moving. Contact zone at synergy.com.na and share your fun news, products and services. Active Kids, where we actively invest in your future. Welcome to story time. Are you excited? My name is Eki. Well, hello friends. My name is Zoe and I definitely am super super duper excited. So guess what today's story time is about? <gasps> what could it possibly be, Zeki? Well, Zoe, it mm -hmm. has something to do with Christianity. Ooh, Christianity? Mm -hmm. Is that going to be our theme for the week? Well, our theme this week has a lot to do with Easter, but mm -hmm. today we'll be speaking a little bit on Christianity. But Zoe, you're disturbing my story time, oh, so sorry, let sorry. me speak. I'm sorry, Zeki. You mm -hmm. can speak now. Alright. Once upon a time, Long, long, long ago, uh -huh. there was a boy named Joshua. Joshua. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And Joshua believed in God. God? Mm -hmm. Who is God, Zeki? Well, God is the creator of the heavens and the earth. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I remember. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then what happened, Zeki? Well, Joshua went out to preach the word of God. <gasps> okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So he preached and he preached and he spoke all about the Bible. Mm -hmm. One good afternoon mm -hmm. he met a group of atheists <gasps> um i remember this word atheists are people who don't believe in the word of god mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. spot on zoe how can you be so smart stay with me zeki well of course i'm with you back to the story mm -hmm. So as he met the group with atheists, he started to speak a lot about Easter. Mm -hmm. So the when he spoke about Easter, he touched on the crucifixion story. <gasps> Not the crucifixion story. Mm -hmm. When God, when G God sent His only begotten Son to die for our sins, who is who, Zoe? Jesus! Mm -hmm. So Jesus died for our sins on the cross of Calvary. Hmm. Mm -hmm. So when he told them about the story, they chased him away. Oh, what? Why? Because they don't believe in the word of God. That's sad. Mm, not really, Zoe. And I'll explain why. Okay, why then, Zeki? Wait a minute, Zoe. You're oh. spoiling my story time. I'm sorry, Zeki. Mm -hmm. So, as he went back, he decided to give the atheist one more chance. Mm -hmm. He met with the head of the atheist, who was um, Ivan. Ivan? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, as he met with Ivan, he told Ivan a little bit more about how this world came to being and not only the crucifixion story. Mm -hmm. And he told Ivan a lot about how God sent his son Jesus to die for our sins. So every time during Easter, it's basically renewed. Mm, well, that makes a little sense. Mm -hmm. But as he told him this story, Ivan still didn't budge. <gasps> what? Why? 
Well, he just doesn't believe that there is a God. He believes in the Big Bang Theory. What? But I think that is supposed to be a theme on its own. Mm, I agree. Nonetheless, Joshua went home and prayed and these were his exact words. Mm -hmm. God, please forgive them as they do not know what they are doing. Oh, that's so sweet of him. Mm -hmm. And he said, he told all his friends that, listen, do not judge atheists because atheists are people just like you. So we should all leave the judging to who? To God. Oh, yes. And that is the end of our story. Do not judge those that do not believe in God, but rather guide them and share with them as much as possible. Mm -hmm. So that's it from today's story time. See, See you, you again. again. Bye. Flex is a health and fitness show that focuses on mind, body and spirit. Flex aims to reach all audiences that would love to focus on the health of the mind, body and spirit. The show is broadcasted on NTV, 1up2.com and cross-shared on the following Facebook platforms. The Republican, Agamana Zeitung, Namibian Sun, Namibian Media Holdings, Sports Rep, Irongo, My Zone, We and Ewi. Flex focuses on daily fitness where we will be flexing our muscles, wellness interviews where we will be flexing our mind. For editorial and advertising queries, please contact zone at synergy.com.na. Active Kids is an initiative under my zone that aims to provide exciting and easy activities and fun stories. Zoe, Zaki and Zoshi are the puppets who share their stories and help children to learn more about the specific focus areas of the day and week. On this show, we have arts and crafts where we create fun and unique art projects with the children which ties into the theme of the day. Each show also has a slot dedicated to fun and easy active activity that the children can do at home with friends and family. The aim is to exercise their minds and bodies in fun and easy ways to keep the children active and moving. Contact zone at synergy.com.na and share your fun news, products and services. Active Kids, where we actively invest in your future. Wow, I'm very, very, I've learned so much in just the, that little story that I heard from Zoe. I learned a mm. lot about Christianity and it's so interesting to find out what some of the things that people really get up to when it is Easter weekend and Easter Friday, Easter Sunday. It's very, very interesting, Mario. Did you learn mm. something? Oh, I did. And mm. I'm here wondering, I mean, how did they get to, to know so much about Christianity? You know what? I, I can't wait to do what to, to see what they to, to hear what they have to say about the, uh, the other oh, religions. Exactly. You know, Zoe and Zaki always come through. And speaking of them coming through, right mm -hmm. now we're going to head on over to them while they teach us a little bit more on Christianity. Let's get learning. Hello, 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 how are you? I'm good, I'm good, I'm great, I'm great, I'm wonderful, hooray! Hello, 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 how are you? I'm good, I'm good, I'm great, I'm great, I'm wonderful, hooray! Hello, all my beautiful, beautiful friends. My name is Zoe. Well, hello there, friends. My name is Zaki. And we are niece and nephew. Welcome back to your favorite show, friends. With your favorite friends, Zoe and Zaki. I'm so excited for today's topic, Zaki. I'm so incredibly thrilled, Zoe. But let's not put off telling our friends what we have to say today. So, Zaki, do tell me, what do you know about non-Christianity? 
Well, non-Christianity is someone who does not follow the Christian faith. Something like... An atheist? Mm -hmm. But Saki, the missionary aspect of Christianity has never changed. Our Jesus gave his followers the mission to spread the gospel to all people at the end of his early ministry. Yes, but there are many ways to be an atheist. Atheist meaning a non-believing or a non-believing person who rejects the existence of God or gods, including calling yourself a humanist, free thinker, skeptic, secular, or spiritual but not religious. Having a doubt about supernatural events doesn't always mean having a doubt about God. But Zoe, don't you think we frequently use the word belief without fully understanding its meaning? He claims, in reality, most people have at least some competing world views. Yes, we do, but an agnostic who rejects all belief in God or gods was impressed by how many ways there are to make sense of life's great concerns with and without a concept of God or gods. Religion and a lack of belief can coexist peacefully for some people while being uncomfortable for others. The distinction, for example, isn't even meaningful for most people in Japan. But the Bible says Paul warns believers not to associate with non-Christians in 2 Corinthians verse, chapter 6, verse 14, asking what fellowship has righteousness with wickedness or what has light with darkness. The conditions of unbelievers can and should be understood by believers, but we must never imitate their lives of atheism. Mm -hmm. If religion is denied as the belief in spiritual beings, then atheism is the rejection of all religious beliefs. Yet in order to grasp atheism enough, one must read the phrase rejection of religious belief and realize how inaccurate it is to characterize atheism as the denial of God or the gods. Mm -hmm. Don't be alarmed, friends. This is just a small discussion. Since this week is the week of Easter celebrations, we want to dive into a discussion on religious and their common practices. With that said, we have come to the end of the show. But before we leave, it's time for us to sing a song. Mm -hmm. And, and a, a one, one, and a two, and a one, two, three. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse went up the clock. The clock struck one, the mouse went down in hickory dickory dock. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse went up the clock. The clock struck one, the mouse went down in hickory dickory dock. So, Zaki, can you please share today's fun fact with us? Did you know the majority of the non Christian in the United States? are male and quite young. Oh, what? That's quite interesting. Indeed. But I think that's it for today, friends. See you again. Bye. Bye. Active Kids is an initiative under my zone that aims to provide exciting and easy activities and fun stories. Zoe, Zaki and Zoshi are the puppets who share their stories and help children to learn more about the specific focus areas of the day and week. On this show, we have arts and crafts where we create fun and unique art projects with the children, which ties into the theme of the day. Each show also has a slot dedicated to fun and easy active activity that the children can do at home with friends and family. The aim is to exercise their minds and bodies in fun and easy ways to keep the children active and moving. Contact zone at synergy.com.na and share your fun news, products and services. Active Kids, where we actively invest in your future. Welcome back. 
you know mm-hmm. what ne? i just learned more than i thought i would ever learn i didn't know that um christianity has so much depth into it and that there are people out there who are actually I know that there are different religions, but there are people out there who are actually called non-Christians, which yeah. is the total APS. opposite, yes, mm-hmm. of Christians. No, it's. It, I wouldn't say it's the total opposite. Mm-hmm. Uh, the total opposite of Christians, I would say it's kind of, is it paganism or what? Is it? Yeah, it's, that's what Christians call them. But is an it? atheist is someone who doesn't believe in any religion he doesn't believe there's a god mm-hmm. he doesn't believe in buddhism he doesn't believe in christianity he doesn't believe in whatever wow just, you're repeating what just... zaki said <laughs> see you were listening I mean, you what were can I listening say? <laughs> <Marianne>. <laughs> you I was were listening. listening okay yes. it's, that's very very interesting it's a very mm. very wide concept Definitely. so there's a lot of different people who believe in a lot of different things out there Mm-hmm. But nonetheless, since we did not gi- give you a song in the beginning, right now we're going to incorporate sing, singing sing, sing, sing. and learning and all your favorite things together in mm-hmm. one. And this is my favorite part of the show. So today we're going to sing. But why do, you, do, why do you always have to do it in a, a cappella? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you should get, okay, you should get like to, musical. You're to beatbox. <laughs> you know, <laughs> maybe innovation is not the sponsors. The sponsor asked with some speakers. <laughs> okay, yeah, but that was a joke, guys. It's, we are very grateful for innovations. Definitely. Yeah, we couldn't ask for more. This is. Yeah, so next yeah, time we'll ethical. probably move, you know what? Next time we'll carry like a whole beatbox and then we're going to mm-hmm. bust a few moves. We're going to yeah. dance a little bit, get on the I our mean, feet. when you have music in the background, even just, you know, <laughs> live and show up and uh, stuff. Yes. But yeah, uh, this is what we do, guys. Definitely. Then it's what we'll be doing. <laughs> Okay, so let's so go. All of your houses. And <laughs> <laughs> a one, and a two, and a one, two, wait, wait. three. There was a farmer. Oh, that's so. I was gonna. Ask oh, what song are you singing? Okay, okay. There was a the farmer had a farm, and Bingo was his name. No, 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 no. <laughs> there was a farmer who had a dog, and Bingo was his name. B I N G O B I N G O. B I N G O and Bingo was his name. Oh, okay. Now I know the song, <laughs> right? So what's going to happen is we'll count down the letters, right? And when we count down the letters, we're going to replace the letters with the sounds of a dog. What's the sound of a dog? Woof woof. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. You make a good dog. I like dogs. <laughs> you make a good dog. Yeah. So we're going to replace the letters with the sound of the dog and we're going to go down until we reach the last letter mm-hmm. which is of course O. For you don't if you don't know how to spell bingo, bingo is spelled B I N G O. B I N G O. Yeah. And our friends told me if you are out there watching, you can sing along, you know. Definitely. Let's see if you can remember the, the, the letters. Exactly. And the song. So let's go. Marian, mm-hmm. and a one, and, and a two, and, and a one, two, three. There was a farmer who had a dog, and Bingo was his name. Oh, woof, I, N, G, O. Woof, I, N, G, O. Woof, I, N, G, O. And Bingo was his name. There was a farmer who had a dog, and Bingo was his name. Oh, woof, woof. I, uh, <laughs> you see, it's not okay, as easy. Woof, okay. <laughs> it's not as easy. I failed the second attempt. Okay. <laughs> Friends, don't be like me. Ne? Please be a lot smarter. Practice makes perfect. Definitely. So let's go. Okay. okay. Let's there was a farmer who had a dog, dog, and Bingo was his name. Oh, woof, woof. N-G-O, woof, woof, N-G-O, woof, woof, N-G-O, and bingo was his name Oh, Let's pick up the face. There was a farmer who had a dog and bingo was his name Oh, Woof, woof, and ah! <laughs> <laughs> It's your turn to face. <laughs> it is oh not goodness. easy. Oh my I gosh. Mean, it's it's picking up We are supposed to be good face. examples. <laughs> okay. We are just we messing up the whole thing. Okay, but we're going to try. Let's but pick there's up no the shame in, in failing. Definitely. Remember that, yeah. We'll so let's try pick again. up the pace. I think mm-hmm. it makes it a little bit more harder. Let's go. Okay. And a one, and, and a two, and a one, two, three. There was a farmer who had a dog, and Bingo was his name. Oh, 
Woof, 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 NGO. Woof, 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 NGO. Woof, 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 NGO. And Bingo was his name, oh. There was a farm who had a dog, and Bingo was his name, oh. Woof, 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 NGO. No, 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 no. Okay, One last okay. try. <laughs> okay. One last try. I'm going to give you another last try because you okay. know that's what I do. I'm a good it's friend. It's so hard to do everything at once, to keep track of the woof, mm -hmm. the letters, and still the sync. I still we find a trick to do, you know, to make sync. it a bit easier. Okay, I think How we, many should, letters count, does I think we should count the woof woofs. Ah! <laughs> 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 Go, that's what I had in mind. Oh, you just like, okay. you can't speak to that of my mind. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Made it materialize. So there's B-I-N-G-O. Yeah. B -I -N -G -O. I -N -G -O. So yeah. there's I. And we are, we are at the fourth one. We are at woof, woof, woof. Woof, woof is it? Because B-I-N-G-O. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. Bingo. G-O. So it's G-O. So we're at B I N G O. So we are G O now. So it's gonna oh. be woof 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 G O. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> one and two and one two, two, two three. There was a farm who had a dog and Bingo was his name. Oh, woof 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 G O. Woof 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 G O. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no friends. I uh, think we're we gonna <laughs> leave it to you guys to, to finish it up yeah. and tell me, yeah. Definitely. We need, we we're gonna practice. Mm -hmm. We're yeah, gonna we're after gonna we practice. take our nap with Zeki and Zoe, we'll yeah. definitely practice. And friends, if you happen to, to you know um do, do what we did and mm -hmm. you happen to do it right, you can send us a video exactly. and we'll check it out. Yeah. That's on our Facebook platforms mm -hmm. um as well as Instagram and YouTube. YouTube, yes. But for now, for me my friend and Teresa, we're gonna take a nap. Yeah. It is. It's been a long day. Yeah. Bye. 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 <laughs>